hello guys welcome back to my channel how are you all doing i hope you guys are all doing amazing and all those good stuff if you're seeing my face for the very first time you're welcome you're so very much welcome my name is blessing my husband and i we are satisfied agent currently living in north cyprus so this way if you want to study in north cyprus this is the agency for you my email is on the screen and also our website is on the screen contact me through the email so we can get started on your process and everything share these videos to your loved ones to your friends your family people that you know that are interested in studying in north cyprus share this video to them because it's going to be very helpful and also if you want to know more about north cyprus based on my own view based on how cyprus is this is a channel for you so please click the subscribe button turn on your notification do all those good stuff for me and and to my old subscribers, guess what guys, you guys rock, you guys are amazing, thank you so much. Without further ado, let's just get into the video. Um, yeah, so, in case you don't know, <laughs> I think this is my, my line, in case you don't know. Anyways, anyways, so, um, it's summer. It's officially summer night. It's officially very, very hot. So I have with me a cup of cold water. You can see the this thing here. It's, it's really hot. It's really hot. So yeah, it's that time again. I'm very happy because um, comment below if you guys want to see summer and vlogs and all that because I think I have some plans of going to the beach and all those things too. Um, Yes, yeah, so that just by the way. Okay guys, so in this video, I'll be talking about um, work, job, work experience, how is it post-COVID-19 in North Cyprus? So after the COVID-19, how has um, getting a job, finding a job is in North Cyprus? Okay. Oh God, my neighbor is making noise. And he was sleeping Anyway, sorry for the noise in case you hear his voice. Um, so now, um, first of all, I just want to break down this thing again for you guys so you get to understand and everything. So I, I'm also, I don't know how people used to link. Please, if you're a YouTuber watching me and you know, please help a sister out. If you know how they link card of old video is like previous video, not the, let me say the recent 10, 10 video. No, the old ones that you've done for about like couple of months ago if you know how to because i don't used to see it except the recent video if there's a way please tell me i'll be very grateful anyway so the point is i'm gonna link cards on the, i think my most watched video is from that work and study that i talked about i also did a recent video about um getting finding a job in north cyprus i also did um another video of personal um businesses that you can do in north cyprus so please go check it out but definitely i'm going to link everything on the description box so that you get um just have time and watch and just know everything that you need to know all right so now let me just give a background of jobs in north cyprus so that you guys will get to know in case you've not watched that video but i really really recommend that you go check my description box you will see the videos watch take your time and watch you understand a lot of things you really understand um, so let me just explain a, in a nutshell. So in North Cyprus, generally, so North Cyprus is a growing country. So that being said, um, there are things, blacks, somebody said I should not use black, I beg, are we white? <laughs> Africans, um, we are a kind of, um, they're beginning to understand us, they're beginning to embrace us, they're learning us. I think 15 years ago, there was not such thing like a um, black residing here in North Cyprus. So they're just beginning to integrate us into the system in a way. So this brings me to the kind of jobs that we have. We want to talk about the white collar job that we have here in North Cyprus for the foreigners. When I talk foreigners, because there are so many foreigners in case you don't know, we have so many foreigners, but their skin, their light skin, we have, um, Asia's them and everything, but they're less. I'm talking about with Africans, the black skin. So, um, for a white collar job that you see, based on my knowledge, and if you're watching me in North Cyprus and you know, please comment down below. 
the one that I know is that um there is this um in in, in the schools in schools um there is international office black works um you see blacks in international office top one of the white scholar job that I know is um, lecturing. There are blacks, blacks that are lecturing here in North Cyprus. There are lecturers here in North Cyprus, both female, both male. There are blacks that are lecturing here in North Cyprus. So I will call that one a white collar job. International office, there are, um, what am I saying white? There are blacks working in international office. Call center, now we're digressing. Call center, me, I'm working in the company, company where I take stock and everything. My company is a very big company. I never started from here. It was a process, okay? So, um, you can have opportunity to work there. So, let me just call me, because me, I call my own job, um, semi-white collar job, because, um, sometimes I can go to the feed. Sometimes I'll be taking stocks and everything. So, let's just call that one. Uh -huh. So, uh -huh, another one that I said that there is a black girl that I know of, that is working as a doctor here in is it doctor or nurse? If you know, let me know. But working in the hospital here in North Cyprus, okay. So there are bits and pieces of all those kind of white collar job. Mm -hmm. Call center. If I didn't mention, those are the kind of white collar in a way job that you can be looking good and be going to work just like the way I do. Um. Now, let me talk about the most popular one, the most visible one that blacks, jobs that blacks, they get here. And this thing gets me um, irritated and it gets me angry. But I just want to let you guys know that for the fact that I'm having a channel, um, I'm, you're not seeing me, you've never had contact with me. It doesn't mean that I'm not somebody's um, sister, I'm not somebody's um, wife, mother, um I'm not somebody's friend. I have blood flowing through my wound, my veins because some people say some crazy things and it just gets me upset, but I don't reply. Guess what I do? I always use the block button perfectly. If you don't know, I use the block button because such thing cannot be happening and you expect me to say something different. If your experience is bad, it's bad for you. Try to work on yourself. If it's good for people that it's good for, they will definitely say it's good. Okay, don't get it twisted. I have been in North Cyprus. There was a time, a long period of time that I was looking for a job. I didn't get a job. But finally, I still got a job. And this thing that I'm telling you is a process. And this it also even leads me to, please, you guys should please sub, um, support my other channel. I'm going to put the name of the channel here. I talk about my experience because I just kind of want to make this um, channel basically solely for um, school study and everything okay this is the niche of this channel so in my other channel i talk about my own personal experience everything that i've experienced living in abroad i've stayed in asia i've stayed in europe yeah so talk about things that i've experienced in abroad so that's just by the way so um Okay, so um, I get uh, irritated. I get irritated when people say some trash. All right, so let me just use my experience because now I'm all over the place, but let me just calm down. Um, let me use my experience. Firstly, when the first job that I got here in North Cyprus, well, let me think, let me think, let me think, let me get the right one. The first job that I got here in North Cyprus, I'm not ashamed to say it because right now the story is not the same. The first job that I got here in North Cyprus was housekeeping. I was I was um, doing housekeeping in one woman's house. Why I was even okay? That was a summer. Then I also got another job. In I would say the job has two fates. It has the place that because it's a um, pomo grenade, I will just put that inside. You see, pomo grenade factory. So we process from the start to the finish. So we produce local pomo um, grenade juice. Is the juice we also produce then um, alcohol too from pomo grenade. That one is just gonna be just head over to the other of my channel. Support, subscribe, turn on your notification. You're gonna hear so many experience from there. I'm sorry, my neighbor is making it, but you're gonna hear so many experience from there. So um. Yeah, so I and that work that pomegranate juice work that I work in is a is a company where they produce juice pomegranate. Um, it's two sides, like I said. We had the one that will go to the farm and um turn on the water, check some things and everything when the when the plant is growing. Then there's a, there's gonna be the season where 
I'm, I'm beginning to forget the season. I think it's around the season. I think around the season. No, this season now we are going to watch water the plant and everything. Then so when is um the season of the harvest? We'll go and pluck. And that time, why I like going because I knew that this is just a phase. This is just a phase in my life. I knew that um and another thing again, it pays more. If you go to the farm, you get more money than the ones that are in the company and all that. So I'm just rushing because I don't want this video to be very long. So. We'll go to the farm, pluck the pomo crane, just to pluck. You wear our gadget, everything, so you not get insect and all those things. I'm even happy experiencing that. Um, yeah, because it's my experience, it's my life experience. Nobody can take it away from me. So yeah, so I pluck the pomo crane and everything. They will not take it to the company where we process from the start to the finish. So there is job like that. There is also um the next one that I got. The next job I got. The next job I got. Okay, yeah. The next job I got is here. No, before then, let me calm down. So before then, I knew that I worked somewhere in two restaurants. And guess what? It wasn't up to even a week. There is one that I worked for one week. There is one I worked for just one day in a restaurant. So that's just going to be a story of another day. So I'm just trying to tell you the experience and what is obtainable. Then, <laughs> then. Still, God now still now favored me because my husband has been working in this company that we're working. All this process that I've been passing through, he has been working there. So finally, finally, they now accepted me in this company. Then I started doing a good job working in the computer and everything. Still, sometimes I go to the field and our field is a kind of like a store. You saw now it's not like uh, going to farm where it's like a store, show glass and everything. So, but most of the time, I'm in the system and everything. So this is what it is. So um, this is a kind of job that you can get here in North Cyprus. Also, I would like to say, one thing I would like to say is that ask your friends, ask people that have been abroad. Ask people in America. Ask people in um, um, Canada. What do you think about all this um, um and white supremacy and all these things that are, that are shouting about in America. What do you think about this? In America, that I know, because I have friends there, in America that I know is that there is a position, this one, that are born, this one are native, it's not even African, Native Americans, they were born African American. There is a position that a black cannot hold. It's just only white. If you don't know, you don't know. That, one, that, that means you're sleeping under the rock. There are just some positions you can hold. This thing is everywhere. In Canada, Ask people before you not get that or if you're a nurse or whatever you do before you get it, you have to do survival job. So this is what they call survival job. It depends on how you feel, it depends on how you see it that it will work for you. But one thing again I would like to say, don't get it mixed, don't don't get it twisted. The work that you're working um in the farm or whatever, if you can accumulate it in one month they pay the same thing with people that are sitting in the office so that is how no cyprus is but the fact that you're working a lesser job in i would like a survival job doesn't mean that um your money is like so small no they pay you good best based on my knowledge they pay you good just know that one all right again so let me go for the guys it's construction job construction construction job that you see like um uh, a, a, a carpentry factory they need a help assistant and this is the same thing that they do in canada they just need a, a assistance is all these new immigrants that, that work there i don't know the different thing that you guys are in fact i don't know let me just continue so construction work you go there you assist and everything before long there are some people that came like they don't they didn't know anything about construction from learning, learning they now become big and patron there is one cameronian if you're in north cyprus you're supposed to know this cameronian he now owns a company here in north cyprus so what are we saying what are we saying is a citizen here what are we what are we saying is a cameronian if you're in north cyprus comment below you know this guy okay this is just one of those all right so um for guys construction Working in Sanaye industrial areas, different kind of thing. You can work where they are doing cars. You can work where they are doing factories. You can work where they are doing, you know, industrial area just to be a helper. You'll be helping bring this, do this, do this, clean, this, do clean or something like that. Yeah. And also again, uh, for um, for female, another one that is really popular. But I, I even tried when I was looking for a job those days. 
I really tried to get that kind of a job, but it didn't happen for me. Um, restaurant, working in a um, not even re- okay. not even restaurant now, working in a hotel, like uh, care um, housekeeping. Yes, housekeeping, working in a hotel, housekeeping, and all those things. There are people working there. Okay, so these are the kind of job you can see here in North Cyprus, and if you're not comfortable with it. You can as well create your own business, which I said I did a video. I'm still going to link it for those that are necessary, that, that really wants to know. I'm linking all the videos down below so that you guys will go and watch. Watch for yourself. That place that there is thumbs up, you go down, you see description, you see when I write things up, then I put link. Go there, you watch. I just did the recent video. If you're not comfortable or whatever, you came, let me say, let me just say you were walking somewhere. I don't know. And you want to earn money for yourself, like you want to be your own boss, you can be making hair. When you come, you will hear people that, 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 that are making fortune with hair. Product, so many things you can do for yourself because this country is an untapped land. So people that knows what they do, they get what they want. Because there are people that come to my comments. I just have to say, come to my comment section. Um, say them, if you're an agent, why don't you open up and say there is no job? Why would I tell you that there is no job when me I'm working? How does that relate? Even there is one of my students that came September and she's even Kenya. This summer, is the, the girl is so smart that I don't even know how to eat. Even comparing, but she's going to come to the show because she has a big news to announce this summer. Because we are supposed to meet like two weeks ago, but she now told me, "Oh, sorry, that she's working and she just she just came. This is her first summer. She just came, so she's trying to understand the place. I understand that I just kept her, but she's going to be in this channel by the grace of God. You see her. How did she get a job? She's working, and she's not the only one. She's working. So if I see any comment like that today, I'm just being so blunt. If I see any comment like that, I'm going to block you. And you're not going to see my channel again. Somebody just got a job yesterday. My husband helped our student. So one thing that I would, I would like to say is that you don't expect, please don't expect this to be in your house and job will come for you. Even if you're in America, even if you're in the sky, you cannot be inside your house and expect job to come for you. That doesn't happen. And you cannot just go once. You can't go once. To look for job and you didn't see any job and you say that the uh, cypress is bad there are people there are people and i i pray that this lockdown will finish you see there are people that are enjoying the good of the land as i'm looking do i look like somebody that is hungry there are people that are enjoying the good of this land and there are also people don't get it twisted there are also people that when they come they will not tell them that oh the land is this the land is that the negative side and they will not soak themselves inside there and they will be seeing the negative of the land that is just it cyprus gives you what you you say there is no place there is no place see uh, you should just be searching the internet you hear stories in canada the girl was frustrated for complete one year or six months or so. She didn't get a job because she has been going for it until you go and get a survival job and get start doing something for yourself. So no matter where you are, when you don't go with the right mindset and you don't strive, you have to work. Oh. Let me tell you another thing again. The language, even me myself, I I, I didn't do that. In in Europe, it's popular in the whole Europe. They always have. They don't speak in English. It's not their first um this thing. In Germany, it's Dutch. Oh, that that is how it is in Europe. So when you're coming to North Cyprus, I did a video. Keep just be familiar with my content. Go down and watch. I told you that when you're coming to North Cyprus, forget that thing that we do in school. Or when I was in school, yeah, in North Cyprus, you everybody in the environment that's speaking English. When you come to real life, when it comes to real life, real life, you now know that you need to learn that Turkish. So, like for undergraduate, there is opportunity. There, there is a Turkish class. It's inside your elective. When you're taking that class, take it very serious. Learn very well. Forget those people that are telling you that. Ah, that learn the Turkish very well because if you want to work and study here and everything even as a um, student job this summer and everything if you know Turkish it's going to be on it see Turkish people they are very happy that when you just go there they say Maraba Nasisi eh, eh, Nasisi Bende Yim all this they'll be like oh Turkish billion that means you know Turkish oh they'll be so happy it creates opportunity so you have to know some things that will make you at hedge don't, don't follow the popular or the regular things that you hear about a place and you now swim into the ocean of um, um, darkness.
this is what I just this is just what I can see. And if for meals, I've have seen some meals. If for meals, you go and get a construction job or whatever kind of job, and you see that this job is taxing or you cannot cope, leave. They pay some kind of place they pay every day, some place they pay every uh, week, some place they pay every two weeks, some place they pay every one. If you see that this thing is going to be harmful for me, you live and find another place, there will definitely be a place. And they like men because they believe that men, you can work all this um, power, power job. Because talking people, forget the way they are looking, you know, they, uh, back to back that's how they work so we black they always have this notion of we have strength and everything so just try to understand the system if you're just coming somewhere try to understand the system if i did not say my experience now to you those of you that are watching did you know that i worked in the farm do you know i did um housekeeping for somebody is it the same thing that i'm doing now so um those people that are coming on my comment section this video i'm going i'm so blood i'm so ready because i'm going to be blocking I'm blocking as much as possible because you cannot expect me to come up and yeah and see there is no job in North Cyprus. Why people are getting job and me I'm working? What are we saying now? There is there is a there's a time that definitely you might look for job and you don't find. Maybe one time or two. Keep going and look. Just keep pushing. Keep you will find. Don't go one time, two times and say oh there is no job. You follow those people that talk bad bad about Cyprus. It's gonna be like that. Okay, so that is just what I want to say about that all right so this is the main point of this um video now now jobs now post covid 19. like i did in my video you because that video is going to come up before this one you see that in the restaurants where those places that they employ people people are not going to as in, it's not like normal it's like 70 percent so that will reduce the amount of people employing people do you understand even in the tourism now, this hotel, this time, by Jesus Christ, this time, summer, that all the Europeans, that the uh, Central Europeans are coming inside from the south and everything, they are coming inside, that all the beach everywhere is filled up. But you, it's, it's, it's not only in Cyprus, it happened everywhere. Even if the lockdown has been eased in North Cyprus, but everybody is trying to be easy. They are trying to be calm, as in they are not trying to like expose themselves. You understand? That is just normal human instinct. So things are not the way it is supposed to be. So what I want to say in this um, post COVID nineteen um, stuff is that job, especially for those of you that are experiencing it, just try. The opportunity is not as normal as in, on a normal day, but this is not how it used to be. So just keep at it because employers they don't want to employ because. Um, they're not having enough customers. It's not that kind of a thing. For example, somebody is having 10 customers and he's not having 6. He will want to cut costs and everything and that will affect employing employment. Do you understand? On all this seasonal job and everything. So for this post-COVID-19 jobs and everything, those people that are looking for summer job and all that, I've had um, requests, people telling me all these things. What I will say, what I will comment as in message, when, when you message me in my email, is the same thing that I'm saying here. Just keep going. Keep looking. Go to industrial areas. Industrial areas is called Sanayi. Keep going. Go to there. And you know, like um, some people that that not like because this girl that goes, she has never experienced summer before. Some people that that will get job faster again is people that have already worked somewhere during summer, so they know them. You know that kind of thing. But still, the opportunity is not the way on a normal day because every country is experiencing it but still just keep going keep looking keep searching 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 just keep going go to a place i'm looking for a job ish ish is job just go even if you want to carry google translate they ask you what can you do you say i can do everything i can do i can you understand just try because the situation is not as normal as it's as in on a normal day so yeah so this is just what i want to say because people are asking me you guys are asking me somebody from chad was asking me what is he going to do just go go keep looking go to industrial areas keep looking when you see there is plenty job go there businesses go just ask and ask and ask you definitely find though it will, it will be more challenging than a normal day but just have that positive mindset that it will work and it will work for you all right guys so this is what i want to talk about post 
COVID-19 job in North Cyprus. I hope you guys learn one or two things. Thank you for watching and I'm going to see you guys in my next one. Bye.